So I think the biggest thing um, I've learned since last, uh, the first lockdown, um, is more about the use of technology. I think um, when I look back at the work that we were set in last March, April, um, the work was good, but the way we gave it out wasn't good enough. I think for children, for a, for a proper education, I think we've improved massively since then um, in the way we deliver education um, to the point that I've, you know, at the start of January, our thing wasn't so much how we deliver the education. It's um, it was like fine tuning and making sure that they're up to the same standard as they would be in class. Um, I think the biggest tool, um, the thing I would recommend to everyone would be Loom. Um, I sort of, I, I think it's brilliant. I love it. I use it um, for everything. Um, being able to go through the slides and yet um, for the children to still see my face, to hear my voice. Um, and the fact that you can move the camera around. So there's been times where I've wanted to point something out and I can move my face and my finger to point at the specific thing. I think it's been so beneficial to a lot of children um, to actually see and hear us go through things um, before they then go through their own work. Um, and then I've been using, so for English, we've been using Loom mixed with our visualizers to actually um, model so they can actually see the hand, you know, us modeling the text, um, but they can still see me think about it and how how we would approach different writing and um, how it's not just, I'm just going to write a perfect sentence straight away. They can see me think about it. Um, I think Loom's probably been the best thing that I've used since the first lockdown.